I'm Ariana Aaron Bureau with your FastCast digital headlines for this Thursday, taking a look at today's top stories that we're following. Our crews are out right now, like I said, uh, plowing the roads, keeping them clear. Um, if we start getting slick conditions, they'll be out uh, putting down additional sand as well. Um, but, you know, as the weather is coming down, uh, just urge drivers to, you know, pay attention to conditions, uh, drive slowly and carefully. A message from Alaska DOT crews, winter storm warnings and alerts are in effect across South Central for strong winds, heavy snow and rain. Schools are also impacted with ASD and Matsu going to remote learning today and several schools closed on the Kenai Peninsula. This weather is already impacting thousands with hazardous road conditions. Your best bet is to stay home if at all possible, but plows have been out all night and morning as the Department of Transportation is doing everything they can to keep up with plowing operations. And the Anchorage Assembly wants to amend the municipal code also so the mayor's office cannot enter into an agreement with a contract to operate a municipal building without first getting approval from the assembly. At this week's meeting, Mayor Dave Bronson told the assembly he did not need approval to sign operational contracts. Some assembly members raised concerns, but Bronson said seeking assembly approval for operational contracts could slow down government significantly. And there is a boil notice in effect for the city of Kotzebue. If you need drinking water or using it to make food, washing dishes, or brushing your teeth, the city says to boil it first for a minimum of two minutes. They say a loss of power caused low pressure in the distribution system. And if you need water, you can bring a container to the water treatment plant building and fill directly from those storage tanks. Those are your fast cast digital headlines for this Thursday. I'm Ariane Aaron Bureau. Be safe if you have to be out on those roads. And thanks for watching.